Let's talk about you and the governor. Uh -huh. <laughs> Do you see, foresee any time in the future maybe getting along a little bit better? I've always said that it is about uh, each issue that comes down the pike. For example, we did work very closely uh, at the end of the legislative session in Albany on mayoral control of education. But, but it's issue but by issue. I know, but I, but I feel like in general people feel that you and the governor don't get along, and it may be to the detriment of the people of New York City, even on the subway situation. No, I disagree. I'll tell you why. It's true that there are times we don't get along, because I follow an idea that Ed Koch first laid out. When the governor of New York does something good for New York City, praise him, support him, thank him. When the governor of New York does something that hurts New York City, call him out, oppose it, take it on. And that's what I've been doing. But wouldn't you like to have a relationship with the governor where you sit down, you have a glass of wine, a slice of pizza, and kind of talk things over? Yeah, and look, he and I have known each other a long time. And I've said very clearly to him, and I've said it publicly, do by, right by New York City, do the right thing for New York City, and that kind of relationship can happen more and more. But I would not be doing my job for the people of this city if I saw our interests affronted and didn't do something about it. I, look, New Yorkers don't want a mayor who's going to be a pushover when dealing with Albany. Uh, and by the way, again, I'm using the example of Ed Koch, who I think did a lot of great things and stood up to Albany when he thought they were doing the wrong thing for New York City. If you don't stand up to Albany, if you don't stand up to Washington when they're hurting your own people, what good are you? And so, yeah, it'd be great to have a wonderful relationship. Here's the way to have a wonderful relationship. Be fair to the people of New York City. So Cynthia Nixon really wants to run for governor? Well, you have to ask Cynthia Nixon that. But I don't did know. you encourage her because I have not talked to her about it at all. Because I know you don't get along so well with the governor. Well, that's a true statement. And again, I'd like to get along better with him, but that means I want him to be fair to New York City. So, but uh, Cynthia Nixon's wife works for you, right? Yes. Okay. And uh, you're not encouraging through back doors I have not talked Cynthia to Nixon to run her, for governor. Her wife, anyone about it. Cynthia Nixon, if you know her work, has got very strong views and has been an activist for many, many years on LGBT rights, on education, on a host of issues. I respect her immensely. I think she's a really smart and effective advocate. Can she be governor of New York? She has to decide what she wants to do. I'm only saying I think she's a great person. I think she's a great New Yorker who's done a lot for this city.